All right, got us a homemade trailer here, uh, two horse. Uh, missing a wheel, but you know, it still you know, holds it up. It's actually a really balanced trailer. Tires are in good shape. Should have brought a penny out here, but oh, you can see the, let's see if can, man, that's pretty deep tread. I use it for a camping trailer. Um, put all the pegboard up. There's plastic on the back, so it kind of protects it from the rain. But, I mean, it's great at, for organizing stuff. I mean, I kind of put some chain up so it can hold my camping tables up. And Sorry, it's a mess. Um, but it's a uh, well, it's a good little trailer. I just put a little chain through there and pop that up, wrap it around here and there and this guy, and uh, it's pretty solid. Um, again, good tread. Tread. I mean, got another door here. I mean, you can turn it back into a horse trailer, but I, uh, I don't know. It's been a great little camping trailer. It's just a little heavy for my car. I've got a 2000 Pontiac Bonneville that I don't know. It's just really heavy. A really heavy trailer. I mean, it's just a bunch of a bunch of metal. So, but it's, it rides pretty evenly, it's just, I don't know, I just don't want to tear up my transmission. It seems to ride okay, but it's just a lot heavier than my other little trailer over there, so. Even though I love the functionality of it, I think I should probably get something a little lighter. Same size, but just a little lighter. I mean, it's... doesn't have a title it's a homemade trailer you can get a title for it so anyway thanks for looking